Well, greetings, Leo, and welcome to your horoscope. So, I mean, you know, you're not center stage and flavor of the month anymore. All right, so now Virgo's taking over. And, um, you know, uh, it's like Leo in some ways is like a really lush shag carpet. And Virgo is like, God, getting barefoot in the mud feels so good and gushy. I love it. You know, and so it's like, there's like a little inkling I could give you of the difference of the two signs. You know, it's like, oh, well, this was high art and look at all this I made. And Virgo's like, well, whatever. You know, I'm having a good time. What do you need? You know, is all of that really necessary for a good time? It's a real homecoming. Of primal values and, and it's the virgin and the virgin's also like the baby you know we're all babies we're all virgins and we all want to be touched and part of the touching is just going slowly and appreciating it all as it comes savoring the moment getting in there and that's part of what's going on right now and so for you right now it's like oh i want to eat things you know because second house rules your your mouth so leos are like mmm this is tasty i want this this is good mm. you know i've got a lot of information i'm thinking i want to make good decisions so everything is about family and finances for leo right now so that's your focus that's what you're looking at um and um your creative life should be happy. Your life with your children should be happy right now. Health issues, just keep working on them. Um, career stuff, it's a little in flux. And, well, I mean, you're going to have some happy. You'll have a happy Tuesday, a happy Wednesday, a happy Thursday, because Moon will be in Leo those days, okay? Yeah. So that's going to be that's going to be nice, you know, until Thursday around 5 or so, you know, when it goes into Virgo. Speaking of Virgo...